I'm a mechanical engineer for the forestry commission. Um, basically, I work on um, forestry machinery, like purpose-built machinery, um, tractors, uh, and road-going vehicles as well. Quite a big influence in my life would be my father. He works for my, my cousins and my uncle in a, like a family business, um, and they're blacksmiths, so he's very much hands-on as well. And he's, he's always enthusiastic about uh, whatever he's doing, even when I was a, a kid, um, just like laying flooring and just the odd DIY job around the house. I loved working with him, um, and he was enthusiastic about everything, so yeah, it definitely inspired me. I didn't really get on with school very well. Um, just the classes that, that was available uh, just wasn't really helping me. Um, I found it really boring um, and just it wasn't challenging enough. So it was pointless uh, me staying on at school any further. So whenever I started my apprenticeship, um, it was mostly hands-on. But there is um, reading, maybe like 30% in the classroom. Because I'm interested in, in the things I'm learning about, it, it made sitting in the classroom just quite enjoyable. Um, just sitting with all the classmates as well, they all like it. There was nobody that was bored. So it was just a, a good experience and you enjoyed learning. If I could give any advice to, to teenagers at school, I would say don't worry too much about uh, your career path when you're at school. Just whatever you're enjoying doing in school, just do that and you will find the job once you come out. Um, just as long as you're enjoying it and it makes you happy, that's, that's the best part.